welcome to my video my name is Diana and I'm a beauty and makeup lover and I have a really exciting video because today I'm gonna be showing you and reviewing some of the products from the Harry Potter and She Glam, co she Glam? She Glam collection it comes with a letter and every single product looks amazing so I'm gonna show you okay so I'm not uh, I'm not going to blind you so I'm just you know showing you this way but it is a box a really sturdy box that said have you seen this wizard and then it has a mirror that's amazing and this box comes with two layers so the first one looks like this and it has a letter has a letter which I thought it was so fantastic with a seal on so when you open it it basically has a description of every single product that is here so I'm just going to quickly show you if you want to you can pause the video to read but this comes with the Hogwarts Houses palette set so it has four palettes for the four houses it has four lip glosses for four different brews and then it has a glitter lipstick it has a cauldron lip mask and a brush so let me start to show you some of the products i'm gonna start with the cauldron it has she glam she glam i'm always calling it she glam she glam from glamorous with harry potter then it has this sort of packaging here and it says as a budding witch or wizard you will want to bring this magic cauldron everywhere you go our magic cauldron lip mask features a light lavender color that applies transparent on the lips for a gloss like sheen plus the special bruise ultra hydrating meadow foam seed oil formula nourishes lips over time with continued use don't you just love magic so i'm gonna be opening Opening. and it comes with a little spatula and a cauldron and then on the inside it has the product I think this is such a pretty little tub of lip balm it's so cute so yeah, this is the only product that I'm not going to be putting on today because I have a bunch of lip balms open and I want to use them first before this one, but it's just a lip balm. So the next product that I have here is the lip balm, another lip balm, but this one has shimmer in it. And it's called the Gifted Herbologist Glitter, Glitter Lipstick love the packaging it has a little mandrake here those annoying things and the lipstick itself it's really cute so i hope you can see the lipstick it has little mandrakes and plants all over it has the she glam harry potter and then and then this is how the lipstick looks like it has a bunch of green glitter so i'm going to be trying this So this is how it looks like. The tip just became black. And it's a bit dark. It is definitely really comfortable on the lips. It is a, I would say, regular lip balm, but with shimmer on it. And it made my lips a little bit purple. Let me know in the comments if you are a really hard Harry Potter fan. I love the movies and usually once a year 
I do a marathon of Harry Potter. So the next product that I have here, it's the Hogwarts Houses palette set. So it comes in this beautiful packaging, it has a sorting hat and you can flip it and then you just open it like this. This is how it looks like on the inside. Here is it, it says Hogwarts and then the four houses. Then it has this sheet and comes with the four palettes. So I have done the Pottermore test. You can go to the website Pottermore and do the test to see which house you are and I am Ravenclaw. So I'm going to be showing you the palettes up close and doing some swatches, so just enjoy! chosen for the palettes are on point. The palettes themselves are heavy and they seem they have quality. So I'm very impressed with this product. Now for the second layer of the box, I just remove this part. Once you remove this part, you get to the bottom of the box, which looks like this. And it has a really spectacular brush wand. It is a really sturdy brush. Like if I hit myself with this, it's gonna hurt. And it seems really fluffy as well. And then for the final product of this collection, I have the book. This seems like a book of potions. The Subtle Science and Exact Art Classes. So this is how this one looks like. I gotta say that I think this one is my favorite from all of the products that they came out with. I am gonna use this as a decoration for sure. So when you open it, it has the four lip glosses here and then here it has the potions. So I'm gonna try to show you. And then the lip glosses. So it has the Felix Felicis, Polyjuice Potion, Amortentia and Drought of Living Dead. So it says right here, level up your beauty game and your potion making skills with this collection of bewitching brews inspired by Libashio's Borage's advanced potion making textbook. The Newt Level Course Boot contains four gorgeous potion bottle lip glosses inspired by some of our favorite brews in the wizarding world. As you can see, this has been thought really thoroughly and I'm really impressed with this. And now I'm going to be showing you up close the lip glosses and the swatches. <laughs> Thank you.
I'm going to be doing a look with each of the palettes and let's take the sorting hat to choose our first one. It's a mix between Slytherin and Gryffindor, but I think there's more Gryffindor, so I'm going to start doing a look with Gryffindor. I'm going to start with Daring. I'm going to be applying it right here. I'm going to go with Determination. It has, which has a lion imprinted on, if you can see. Okay, so I just have this sort of shape right here. And now in the negative space in my eyelid, I'm going to be applying bravery. Now I'm going to go with courage. Okay, so this is how this look with the Gryffindor palette turned out. I like it. I think it's a bold look and represents the house Gryffindor, but let me know what you think. And regarding of the shades, the one that I had a little bit trouble with was the Bravery shade because it is a crumbly shade, so when I put my brush on it, I really have to dig the brush to be able to apply a layer of the shadow on my eyeball. But all of the shadows performed fine. They are a bit powdery, but usually that doesn't concern me as long as they are pigmented. So yes, this was look number one. And now the lip gloss that I'm gonna choose for House Gryffindor it's gonna be the Amortensia, the pink one. And this one seems to have a little bit of pigment, but it doesn't have any shimmer on it. And the applicator is really different from what I'm used to. It's just a plastic applicator. It's a bit scratchy, I must say. Okay, so it feels nice. It isn't really, really sticky. And it feels hydrating. So, yes, this is the Hamortensia Lip Gloss. Okay, so let's move on to another palette and let's see what the Sorting Hat chooses now. Ravenclaw. Okay, I'm gonna start with Wisdom. Uh, we'll be taking Creativity. And it has the embossing of an eagle. Now I'm going to be taking Wit. And Curiosity. And this is a look with the Ravenclaw palette. The blue in here, the shade called Wit, is 
absolutely stunning it has blue shimmers throughout it and i love it in the ravenclaw palette i'm gonna choose the drought of living death lip gloss So this one is just a clear lip gloss, really comfortable just like the other. I don't really care for the applicator, I think it's a little bit scratchy. Let me know what you think about this look. Different day, still the same video. So let's see what the sorting hat's gonna choose now. Well, I already did Gryffindor, so Slytherin. I'm gonna start with the shade Leadership. I'm gonna apply it on the crease. Now I'm gonna be taking Destiny. Now I'm going to be taking Ambition. And Cunning. Okay, so this is the look with the Slytherin palette. Let me know what you think. I believe that all of the shadows performed really, really well. This kind of black brown, it's not really a true black, I think, has a snake imprinted, imprinted on it. But this black shade is really pigmented, easy to apply, and they are blendable. But I think this one so far is my favorite look that I've made. Now, the lip gloss that I'm going to choose for Slytherin, it's the Polyjuice Potion. Because it has the green sparkles. so I tried to remove everything to the best of my ability but I have missing some blush and yeah just don't notice that please so now there's only one house that is left which is the Hufflepuff I'm gonna start with the shade dressed worthy Then I'm going to go with Patience. Then I'm going to go with Humility. Then I'm going to add Hard Work. Okay, so this is the look with the Hufflepuff palette. And all of the shades performed really nicely. I must say that humility was a bit too powdery, but I guess the yellow pigment is a hard pigment to make. But they blended out fine and I love this hard work glitter shade was really pretty. Now for the lip gloss for this look I'm gonna choose the Felix Felicis which is the yellow one. And 
And that's it, this look concludes the video. I hope you enjoyed, please let me know in the comments which look was your favorite and which house are you in Harry Potter. So I gotta say that this collection, five stars. Thank you so much for watching the video. Don't forget to be kind to yourself and others and have a wonderful day. See you on the next one.